Mastering English, Fixing Sentence Fragments. Hello, English language learners. Today, we're diving into an essential topic for smooth, clear writing and speaking, correcting sentence fragments. Specifically, we're going to explore how to combine fragments with complete sentences. By the end of this video, you'll be a pro at identifying and correcting these sneaky little troublemakers in your English communication. First, let's refresh our understanding of sentence fragments. A sentence fragment is a group of words that seems like a sentence, but actually isn't. It doesn't express a complete thought or fails to include all the necessary elements of a sentence, a subject and a predicate. For example, in the park. This might seem like a sentence, but it leaves us with questions. Who or what is in the park? Spotting sentence fragments is the first step towards correcting them. Look for sentences that leave you with questions or feel incomplete. Fragments often lack subjects or verbs, or they might be dependent clauses standing alone. An example of a fragment is, although I love reading, because it does not form a complete thought. The real magic happens when we combine these fragments with complete sentences. This can provide extra detail, improve flow, and enhance the meaning of your statements. Let's return to our earlier examples. 1. Fragment. In the park. Complete sentence. The children are playing soccer. Combined. The children are playing soccer in the park. 2. Fragment. Although I love reading. Complete sentence. I don't have much free time. Combined. Although I love reading. I don't have much free time. See how these combined sentences are now complete and provide much clearer information. To master any new skill, practice is key. Try identifying fragments in your own writing or in texts you read. Practice combining them with complete sentences. You'll find your ability to spot and correct fragments improves over time. That's a wrap on correcting sentence fragments by combining them with complete sentences. Hopefully, this lesson brought you one step closer to mastering English sentence structure. As always, don't forget to practice what you've learned. Remember, English is a beautiful language, and you are on your way to mastering it. Until next time, happy learning!